I think uh, maybe my favorite talk um, was from Danny Bassett. And uh, she's someone who I, I wasn't really that familiar with um, her work before seeing the talk, but then afterwards immediately went and read a bunch of papers and now I'm a huge fan. Um, but one of the things that um, really stood out to me uh, was uh, in particular sort of her, her description of her early experience where, um, you know, I would have been very uh, fortunate and privileged to come from a very supportive background um, all throughout my life, but she described having grown up in a community that didn't necessarily um, value uh, the kind of sort of independent endeavors that she was going after and, and didn't have maybe the same sort of uh, conception of uh, 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 the, the role of women in society that, that she was finding herself pursuing. Um, and I, I really, I can't even imagine uh, the kind of uh, sort of courage and determination uh, that one would need to come from that sort of a, a, a um, background and to pursue this very sort of non-conventional path that she's taken. I think her, her research is uh, so creative um, and, and her you know, research program, I think, reflects that kind of um, bravery and determination um, because she really is doing these, these very creative and interesting things in science. And I think so overall, um, sort of hearing her story and seeing her science uh, was very powerful to me. And I, I also think that uh, she ended uh, her talk, if I can find this here, with um, some, some words that I found uh, somewhat inspirational where she, let's see. She emphasized uh, focusing on passion, gratitude, humility, and commitment to diversity broadly construed. Um, and I, I found that sort of system of values to be uh, a quite inspirational. Um, so I think overall hers was my favorite talk.